I'm going to show you how to make um, joining your virtual class much easier for your students. Now, there are two ways you can do that. Now, we've already established that students can click um, the calendar right here and be brought over to the calendar on a new tab. And they can just click on the class schedule or event that you may have set up for them. For, for me, it is module 5. And click on the link here to join your virtual classroom. But you can even go further and make it much easier for them by um, copying that link as I just did. Coming back over to your classroom, click Create Material. I'm going to put the title of my module, just call it Module 5 for now. Then click Add Link. It's my link. Add the link and assign it to my topic. Of course, I can add a description for the instructions here, explaining how, um, what they should do, which is to click the link below. And I can create a post, but I don't want to post it because I don't want to have, I don't want to have this link available um, before the class or long before the class. So I'm going to schedule it. And I'm going to schedule it on the 15th, however. 15 minutes before the class begins. So that's 9.45. That should give them enough time to get some issues sorted out before they enter the class. So it's not available here. But um, for my class to see on the my virtual class topic, the only thing that is grayed out, um, which means it's not going to be visible for the students until 9:45 on the day of the class. Okay, another option is to click meet here. Now this is not initially available um, or seen, and you would have to turn this on. And to do that, let me show you how you can go to settings here. Now, I've already um, set this up in this class. I'm, I want to show you this on a, in a class that I haven't actually set up as yet. So I'm in my settings, exactly where you were in the previous class. I'm coming down. I'm coming down here to um, meet. And this is on the general um, box. So I'm, I want to click this, this button that says generate meet link. It's going to generate a link. Here and that um, would allow you to access the meeting. Now I can copy this if I want to and maybe paste it in my class, share it with my class um, via um, WhatsApp or maybe um, any other medium I choose. Or I can reset it here to just generate another link. And I also want to make sure that this um, toggle is on visible to students to turn it off, just do that, to turn it back on, just hit it again. And then click save. All right, so after you click save, then let me just click X here. Right. After you click save, it would appear right here on the classwork. So your students can now click on this meet button option and be taken directly to their um, Google Hangouts. Now, when you're in here, right here on this page, you have the option to turn off or on the, the mic and also the video before they enter the classroom. I would have them to do that before they enter the classroom. And then they can click join now. So there, that's two ways you can share your uh, to me, you can share your virtual class link with your students. The thing is, um, with this button option, this is this is not shared in the calendar. So, so that means this is different from this link. These are two different links here. But if you do want to add this link to this um, material here that I've posted, you can just click edit, and you can always add the link here as well. Remember that I had copied this link from before um, when I had generated the link and click copy. I had copied it from before, so students can now students can now um, access the virtual class using that link as well. If you would like, Let's schedule again, and that's it.